Greetings, and welcome to another An Hadinia Project episode. Well, today we are going over the newest Evan Jacobs film, Killer. Uh, much like Clerk, it has a period at the end, and is lowercase. But, as always, I try to get our first impressions, and if you want to see this film, amongst many others, you should go on to the Vimeo page for Antedinia Films, and you cat keep trying to get in front and you can get access to many 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 films including this one so let's go ahead with a plot summary killer is simply about a hired killer who is driving to his job and him at the job and then I guess his drive back so it was pretty simple over there uh, the writing, well, I'm not even sure how much writing, whether it was a script involved. The way that this kind of feels, uh, it's another one of those monologuing type uh, films. It really does feel like there was a trip that was planned out that I have to drive, so why don't I pick the camera and film? And it comes up with a basic idea for a story, and then I'm going to just follow along the story as I go. And this is kind of cool. I mean, it works pretty well, as says it's supposed to work. But <laughs> there are, uh, you know, it does kind of have that, uh, what's the word, pacing issue, and does drag throughout. There are a couple of things that I do enjoy about this. I kind of like the ending of it. Uh, I think the ending is fine. It's actually kind of funny. So that's an enjoyable part. And I do think that this one is a little bit easier to follow than, um, than uh, well, than O'Hare. Give my regards to O'Hare, which uh, I felt just kind of rattled along for an hour. This one, I felt like, did a pretty good job of utilizing its time. I do like that it didn't all sit at the car. We did have a part where he got out of the car and he was walking and talking. I did think that was pretty good. I do think that there are a couple of things that were thought through well. Uh, again, I'm not sure whether this one was scripted or not. It didn't feel like it was. I feel like there was an outline and then went for it. <laughs> but uh, as far as films go, this is not too bad. I think that uh, with all the films released, so far the majority of them are pretty good. They're pretty uh, nice bangers out, out there. So... You know, you got so many bangers, it occasionally you'll have not so much as it goes on. But, with that being said, still done well. Lighting is decent for where it was. I thought the picture quality was okay. I uh, had some trouble with Vimeo, uh, so I had to... I eventually set it on the lowest setting, and it was able to play without buffering too much, and that was good. Um and a lot of those problems did get fixed as time went on. But that's my take on Killer. Again, a decent film. If you are one that likes those, uh, the types of monologuing pieces, uh, pieces like I Give My Regards to O'Hare, um, Taking a COVID Test, those fall on the same lines there. So I thought that uh, this one, if you like those, I think this one is still down your alley. But well, let me know what you think of the movie in the comments down below. And again, for just $2 a month, you can check out the Anhedinia Productions site on Vimeo, where there are lots of fun things to be had. And of course, uh, the Shackle Demon Project there, for a little bit of extra, you get access to that one as well, uh, for rent or for buy. So check it out. And of course, uh, let me know in the comments below what you think of Killer. Did it slay you? <laughs> but we'll see you 
on the next one. Bye-bye.